case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1986 case, the Florida District Court of Appeal heard May v. Muroff, which revolved around the notion that when someone causes permanent damage to land, they must pay the difference between the value of the land before and after the harm occurred. The situation began when a seller breached a land contract by selling fill from the property to a third party before the final transaction to the buyer was completed. The trial court initially ordered the seller to pay damages based on the cost per acre removed. However, upon appeal, the court reassessed the calculations for damages and determined that the buyer should receive compensation for the value of the materials removed, which amounted to $240,000. As the seller's breach was deliberate, the court ruled that he should not be allowed to profit from his wrongdoing. The decision was upheld in part and reversed in part, ultimately ordering a final judgment in favor of the buyer. The court noted that the trial court had made an error in calculating damages and should have awarded the buyer the $240,000 that the seller made from selling the fill. The case was thus sent back to the lower court for a final decision in favor of the buyer. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.